Hi, all. welcome to OS Minds. Today we'll discuss about the Docker installation on Amazon Linux machine. So this is my AWS console. So currently I have one machine running. So let me log in into that machine with the help of public IP. So this is public IP. So you can use any one of the SSH client. So far now I have a mobile XTEM to log in into the Amazon Linux machine. So just click on sessions, SSH. So in the remote host, you just paste the IP address which we have taken here. This is the IP address. And click on advanced SSH setting. Use the private key. So here we need to select the PPK format key. Click on OK. So here you can log in into the default user, ec 2 fn user. So these are steps simply and straightforward. First, check the any updates. So I believe no packages have been updated here, so no need. So now just install the Docker with the help of m install iPhone y Docker. Yeah, Docker has installed. So click on Docker. So which means once you have installed the Docker, you will get these things. Or else you will check the Docker. Yeah, I need to start the Docker, so which you have installed, and just start with the help of service Docker start. So Docker has started, and then check the info. Now you will get the information about the Docker, so which is uh, the memory size of the machine, CPU, and debug mode, debug mode is fans, and this is about the kernel version. And this is docker root directory and uh, yeah these things about the docker so now we have installed the docker and start the machine start the docker with the help of service docker start and if you want to stop service docker stop just click on service docker stop docker will stop okay so then we'll start once again yep docker is started so now we'll run simple one image so we'll check the first any images are running on this machine so in order to check the machine check the any machines running on Current we don't have any images. We'll run one simple image. Docker run hello world. Yeah, so this currently we don't have this docker image in this machine so that's why the docker has taken from the hub.docker.com yeah in order to more details you can check the docker.docs.docker.com 
so we get so many images there so now the image has installed here so to check the image status so images so now we have hello world image here and this is the image id so that's how we need to take the images from the docker so to remove the docker image so docker image rm rf hello world yeah docker image has removed so now if you want to check docker image now the image has gone so this is how we need to check the process and yeah you can check the docker containers which are running on this machine so currently we don't have any docker containers on this machine yeah this is all about the docker installation and the image creation of an image and then to start and stop the docker so now finally we'll check about how to remove the docker from the mission yum remove docker yum remove click on yes yes no there is no docker here so this is how we need to remove the docker from our mission so stay stay home and stay safe so for more details please check please contact www.vsminds.com thank you for watching this video